I'll show you how to use the SQL in Jungle. So basically, SQL in join is used to connect two tables, two or more tables, using a foreign key that is the uh, primary key of the first table and then the foreign key of the second table. So let's start by creating two tables. Okay, let's create a master file for uh, for lorry, okay, for trucks. Okay, create table uh, lorry. ID first field the second field is uh, let's put a lorry number okay let's just assign a bar car uh, say the link is 12 and then let's put a number bar car 12 okay then the Primary key is ID. Okay, this one enough. Okay, now we have a first table. Okay, ID Lauren and plate number field. So let's insert data. Okay, ID, lower number, and plate number. Values will be, it's one. Lower number is one zero one. And plate number is ABC one one one. Okay, let's go base and let's create three lorry or truck. So we have two zero two and three zero three lorry number D F two two fit with three and G H I okay okay now we have inserted three lorry okay we have a uh, Lorry 101 Remember that ID is the primary key. Okay, this one is the one that we'll use to connect to the second table. Okay, let's create the second table. It's more of a transaction table. Something like Lorry uh, orders. Insert data. 
some more data into the lorry orders. Okay. ID. Lorry ID. Order number. Customer name. Values are two. This one. Okay. Lorry ID. This one, lorry ID, is the ID the lorry table. Okay. So in the lorry orders, this is a foreign key. Foreign key that is match to the primary key of the lorry table. So in this case, let's try uh, ID2. Okay. Lorry ID2. Order number is. Uh, a-101 Customer name is uh, Section BC Okay, let's copy And then let's say Second one Third one, fourth one, fifth one Fifth ID And then let's say so it's One, one Lorry ID is three Order number is 102, 03, 104, and 105. Customer name. So this one is G. This one is complex. Okay. And Petron B. Petronas. Okay. Let's run. Then let's check the data of the second table. Lorry orders. Okay. So now we have uh, five rows of data in the second table. Lorry orders. So we have the ID, lorry ID, order number, and the customer name field. So. We will use the inner join. Okay. We will connect. Uh, we will connect. Uh, Lori that ID field to Lori orders that Lori ID field. Okay. Start. Select asterisk from uh, lorry orders. Put an alias. O. Inner join. Lorry. on now we put the condition this is where we will connect the primary key to the foreign key so primary key is the lorry okay, i forgot the alias so we put l as an alias for lorry so we will connect it on l that id okay l that id is this one the lorry id that way ID is equal to O at the lorry ID field. So this one. Okay. O that lorry ID is this one. Lorry orders that lorry ID. And that ID is the lorry that ID. So you can see the alias of lorry orders is O. One. and the alias of lorry table is L this one okay so now we need to specify here which fields are are we gonna show on the raw on the result let's say for example we want to show the lorry number 
the lorry number is in the lorry table here so let's say l that lorry number okay and the plate number also plate number and then we want to show the order number from the lorry orders so we use the alias o that order number and then the customer name o that customer name so let's put this below so that you will understand more Okay, let's try to run the SQL. Okay, we have the result set. Okay. As you can see, we have uh, connected the lorry ID okay, to the primary key ID in the lorry table so now our result set is the lorry okay 202 you have the plate number DEF222 and order number and the customer name so this is how you use the inner join uh, basically you're connecting the primary key of the first table primary key of the first table to the foreign key the second table okay thank you guys and uh, see you on the next tutorial